you music from Bootstrap. Risky to leave the Twizzle so late in the programme, but successful. Wasn't that fantastic? Just moments of fraying right at the very end, but for the most part, glorious. Love the music. For those who want to know the uh, the middle part, the Can't Help Falling in Love, performed by Ingrid Michelson. And so beautifully portrayed out on the ice. It really is. It's, I'm moved by I, the first two pieces of music, the first two sections of the programme. I think it's so emotional and their connection 
it's just brilliant. It's actually one of my favorite free dances. In terms of the first two parts in particular, it's one of my favorite free dances of all time, never mind yes. just this season. I think it's beautiful and the, the little touches, there are even more uh, embellishments and, and nuances throughout it than there were in their first Grand Prix assignment. Oh, that's really lovely to see. That's their training mates. That's lovely. It really is. And yeah, just about the skate. Uh, yeah, I mean, that's testament to the environment that their coaches have created. But to me, you know, they were doing the spin and the hand movement as they connected, the, the music, the lyrics, take my hand, those little sections, they're, they're delivered with such pertinence and commitment to the movement. And it's beautiful, really, really beautiful. And having known them both, I know that they're, they've had coaching influ influence and input from so many different sources. They've had English coaches, they've had Italian coaches, they've had Russian coaches. Now they've got French Canadians and French coaches. And yet, despite all those different inputs, their skating technique, they, they've maintained, they've got the same, the exact same skating technique. And they've obviously, between the couple, decided what they want to do and take forward in the way that they transmit their skating. She used to skate through her teenage years with her brother. That routine would have been impossible to do. Well, interestingly, at that time when she competed with her brother on the Junior Grand Prix circuit, there was a lot of controversy perhaps about the sexuality of it and some people were a little bit uncomfortable with it and she's obviously just a very very expressive lady and certainly it's much better <laughs> before we something that's not her sibling now oh, they're probably going to go into first place yes they are look at that number one in the free number one overall just great for them separating themselves from Piper and Paul, which they'll be delighted with.